And I mean, that's the thing, man. It's like, all my life I've been able to process my emotions through movies. And now, all of a sudden, it just feels like there aren't any. What do you mean? There are plenty of coming-of-age films with people our age. Yeah, yeah, but none that really tackle the issues. Think about it. I mean, like, teenagers have their John Hughes movies about, like, puberty and sex and dating. And then the elderly, they've got their BBC dramas. What, to help them deal with getting murdered in a British village? Dude, all I'm saying is, Hollywood seems to have this weird perception that the minute that you graduate high school, it's like, boom, everything's just peachy. But I mean, I don't have my shit together. And you definitely don't have your shit together. Thanks. I don't even know how to do my taxes. I'm about to graduate university and I don't know how to do my taxes. Like, is it an online thing? Do I have to go into a bank? Like, what if I'm some sort of fugitive who's amassed a heap of debt? Next thing I know, I'm going to have a current affair knocking on my door being like, give us the money. I'm not one of those people. I laugh at those people. All right, calm down there, Jason Bourne. What we need to look at is the fact we've got a group assignment due tomorrow. We've only written the title and we spelt it incorrectly. Oh, dude. Relax. It's group work, okay? They practically hand you the marks when they pair you up with the doughy girl from Sutherland and the guy who keeps asking if he's in the right class. It's a day before we present and we haven't even met the group. I don't even know the other girl's name. Well, why don't we be pragmatic here for a second? You have Monique's Facebook, right? Yes. Well, logic would dictate that you should probably send her a message. All right, give me a second. Full disclosure, dude. There's about to be a smell wafting over there that's... <sighs> Damn what? it. I sent a kiss emoji instead of a smiling one. That's not bad, right? I'll just send a correction message. No, 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 no. Don't do that. Okay, it makes you look clingy and desperate. And even though you are clingy and desperate, she doesn't need to know that. Look, I'm not looking to date this group. I just want to assemble them here so we can do this project. Plus, I've got kiss emojis before from friends. It's fine. Yeah, but didn't you think it was kind of weird when they sent them? I guess so. But it can be cute. You're innocent. Maybe one of those people who send it casually, you know. Hey, have a nice day, kiss emoji. Or sorry your dog died, kiss emoji. Listen, take it from somebody who knows better, okay? I sent an emoji to a girl at work and it did not end well. Is this another one of those stories that you conveniently make up to prove a point? So I'm getting out of class, and this girl from my work, she texts me that she's now a vegetarian. And people were making jokes about it, but I wanted to be supportive, because I'm that kind of guy. So I said, guess it's only vegetables from now on, and sent it off with an emoji. She doesn't text me back for a few weeks. And during this time, I'm starting to wonder what could I have done to piss this girl off, you know? It's only then that I realise I sent her an eggplant emoji. I don't get it, what was the issue? Riley, you innocent little thing. The eggplant symbol is code word for dick. <laughs> Who decided this? When was this chosen? When was it like, ah, oh, that's what we'll use to represent dick? Well, I don't know, that's just how language develops. That's how language, we're just gonna take one thing that already means something, then arbitrarily swap it to mean dick? That's language for me. They were just like, oh, we'll just throw everything out and just start again. Okay, well, smart ass, what would you use then? Wait, hold on. What? She's typing. What'd you say? Ha ha, okay. That's good, right? I think you're in the clear, my friend. <laughs> What? Who is it? That Riley guy from our BCM class. Is that the guy with the lazy eye we think has a foot fetish? No, this is the one we had that group assignment with. He wants to know if we're still meeting up today for it. Oh shit, that's today? Mm -hmm. uh, do we have to go? Like, <laughs> this chair is kind of like super comfortable. Lauren, you've been complaining about that chair for the last 10 minutes. Yeah, but like in comparison to this group assignment, it's kind of great. That's weird. What? He sent a winky kissy face emoji. What, like an actual kiss emoji? 
Yeah, like at the end of that message with a wink and a... Actually, when I think about it, he was definitely checking you out in class. What? Yeah, he was being all discreet about it and just like peeking over his shoulder, giving you that side eye. But like, he was definitely checking you out, 100%. Okay, 10 minutes ago, you didn't even know who this guy was, and now he's giving me the side eye? True. So what do I say? Should we just go? Well, like it's due tomorrow, so we kind of have to. Okay, so I'll just say see you soon. Well, no. That's basically you saying, hey, you just flirted with me and I liked it. Why don't you send him the, uh... Laughy crying face. But isn't it the same thing? No, you see, that's the beauty of it. This emoji makes it seem as though you're like, hey, I recognize that you're joking and I will still be there. Okay, so I'll say, ha ha ha, see you there. Laughy cry face emoji, sends. You happy? Mildly satisfied. Trust me, Mon, this situation could be so much worse. Remember when Jess became a vegetarian and then that creep from her work sent her an eggplant emoji? Yes, I would hate to be stuck in a room with that Ooh. guy. He sent another message saying sweet with another winky kissy face emoji. How did you manage to send another kissy emoji? I don't know, it's in my favourite sections now, alright? I don't, I didn't mean to, I didn't mean to hit it, I've just got fat thumbs. Oh, Christ, you look like a sex pest. Man, this guy is obsessed. Are we sure he's not the foot fetish guy? Whatever, I'm done. Let's just send in the slides, I'm fine with a passing grade. As soon as I get home, I'm deleting this guy on Facebook because he's a creep. Well, congratulations, because I'm officially worried about this assignment now. What I'm going to do, because we're not going to the group meeting, is I'm going to go home and watch some Midwife's Tales. What's that? Is it any good? Wait, you've never seen the Midwife's Tales? She can't come. Something has come up. Well, did she put an emoji at the end of the message? No. Is that bad? Hello, how are you? I'm just here listening to nothing. He's filming. Um, he's doing pretty much every job behind the camera, apart from mine, but I have a, a surprise for him. Matt, you're directing. Yeah. That's the plot to it. What? That's too urgent. <laughs> oh my god! <laughs> The <laughs> <laughs> we're I totally forgot that he had to say cut. <laughs> then I'll empty it overnight. So oh, sorry, we can do it in the morning. We can do it in the morning. Okay, three, two, one, action.